3D printing technology makes it possible to create anything as long as you have blueprints and materials. Well, it's now even possible to build a house in a very short period of time using 3D printers. Now, despite the developed technology, commercializing 3D printers in South Korea is yet a task to overcome. Cheng Eunju explains further. A 33-square-meter, two-story house with windows, doors, a staircase, and even a kitchen took only 20 days to build. This was all possible thanks to architectural 3D printing technology. It took just 11 hours to complete the frame and walls, while the house itself was completed in a very short period using prefabricated building components. It only cost 70 million won, or roughly 55,000 U.S. dollars to build. In the current market, it costs about 160 million won to build a house, but with 3D printers, it would be possible to build a house for less than 70 million won. Using a 3D printer means construction without skilled workers becomes possible, while restrictions on weather or location are reduced. Construction waste is also minimized and building costs are cut in half. But under current South Korean law, it is illegal to make a building using a 3D printer that's intended for people to enter. This contrasts with some countries such as the United States and Japan that already commercializes and distributes houses built using 3D printers. Material engineers, experts in mechanics, lawmakers and financial authorities must all work together to commercialize 3D printing for construction purposes. With commercialization of 3D printed houses prohibited, there is an increasing demand for various safety standards regarding earthquake resistance, insulation and residential safety. Chong Eun-ju, Arirang News.